if you hadn't broken my lucky walking stick, we'd all be back in our little fraggle beds at home. Try not to think about it, Pooper. What else can I think about? Hey, how about traveling Matt? I put his postcard in my pocket this morning and forgot all about it. Oh, oh. go oh. Uh, Come on, guys. It might take our minds off the mess we're in. Oh. Uh. Okay, Gobo, it's worth a try. <sighs> Dear Nephew Gobo, I, I have made, made yet another, another amazing, amazing discovery about, about this weird, weird world. Today I observed certain types of creatures here that live in the sky. They swoop and soar and seem altogether as carefree as fraggles. Then I realized that these wonderful creatures were being held captive. They were trapped on the end of strings. Suddenly, I saw a second kind of flying creature. When I saw that, I just had to act. I waited for an opening, and then I set about freeing the captive flying things. <laughs> the first ones flew away into the sunshine. Excuse me. But when I set free one of the other flying creatures, it immediately landed and waited for its master. Evidently, the world here is much the same as Fraggle Rock. In that some creatures value freedom more than others. More news soon. Love, traveling Matt. <sighs> Funny thing. That didn't lift my spirits much at all. Mm -hmm.